it's Presley at ActoGames.com here, and today is Science Sunday, and we are going to be opening our Spangler Science Club monthly kit, which includes our favorite chemical reaction of all time, the b coolest substance in the world, and explosions! So you might have seen Steve Spangler do this on the Ellen Show a few years ago, and he had like a thousand of these filming canisters blowing up. So today we're going to talk a little bit about why that happens, and it's really cool and fun. The first thing that this kit has is our favorite chemical reaction of all time, which we did a little bit on Valentine's Day with the Rainy Day Dreamers, as well as I was actually on the news with Steve Spangler, and there are these little balloons that if you hit them, well, these packets with balloons in them, that if you hit them, the they pop and the balloon comes flying out, as well as Amazing Phil actually did one of these in a video. So it was really cool, and it's basically the same reaction, except with different things. And the second thing that this kit has is our favorite substance on the world, as well as the coolest substance probably in the universe. We might discover something really cool, but right now, it's the coolest substance in the universe. And if you've watched any of my Science Sundays at all, you know that is water. And lastly, but definitely not least, is it includes one of our favorite things ever, blowing stuff up. So you've probably heard that mixing an acid and a base together gets you carbon dioxide. Like in the volcano science projects that people do a lot, where they make the volcanoes and put the baking soda and the water and the vinegar, and it goes explode. And that's not just the case, because this tablet is both mixed together. It is sodium bicarbonate and citric acid mixed together into a single tablet. So it's not fizzing or exploding, and it's been in a pack since a while. It says December on the packet, so it's probably been in there for a while. And if it was been in there for a while, which is a sealed tight container with an acid and a base mixed together, in fact, a bunch of them, you would have think that it exploded. But no, you need the coolest substance on the planet water and actually on other planets too <laughs> but water so you need that and once you add so what this is is a bunch of ionic bonds with the things that are inside of it and they're all happy and stable until you put them in water and water rips those ionic bonds apart and then they those bonds form again to become carbon dioxide and it's kind of scary that water is the best thing at ripping those bonds apart and a lot of our body is made out of water, as well as we drink it on a daily basis. Basis? It's kind of creepy. Harnessing that really cool, simple reaction, you can do a lot of things. Like what we just did with the popper, the baking soda and vinegar volcanoes, as well as this rocket that we're about to set off. So, it's just really cool that this tablet and some water equals explosion. So let's take a look at some of the things with this kit. So the basic experiment here is mixing some water and the fizzy tablet together, then you get the explosion, which we did at the beginning of the video. So what you do is you take one of the film canisters, you put some water in it, then you put the fizzy tablet, then it goes boom. But in this kit, they have these really cool spacers. So you put the water, then the spacer in, and then you put the tablet on top, and the water and the tablet don't touch until you want it to. So you can kind of control when you want it to go off. So let's recreate what we did at the beginning of the video. I'm kind of nervous because I don't like things popping near my face, but let's see how long it takes. Well, oh, it started to fizz. It's fizzing. I'm not going to put my ear that close. I can kind of very faintly hear it fizz. Ah! That scared me. As with all these Steve Spangler science kits, safety goggles are really important, especially when things are exploding like this. Also, recommendation for when you get this kit, Definitely explode it, then hold the tablet. It feels really cool. Okay. As always, the instructions of these kits have these ex mini, mini experiments that you can do, and it encourages you to document your findings. This one has all sorts of experiments you can do, like how much water you should put in, what temperature water, all sort, what canister you should use, all sorts of things to get the best reaction, which to some people means the smallest explosion, and to people like me, the biggest one that doesn't hit you in the face.
Th that's why I really love these kits because they actually like encourage you to document your findings and actually research what's going on yourself. It also comes with this really cool tube that lets you aim the film canisters so you can kind of choose where they go. So I'm going to shoot one right now. <laughs> okay, that scared me. As always, when we do these Penguin Science Club kits, there's a grand finale, so we're not gonna tell you how it works. You can find that out on your own by doing some research, as well as you can find out how the rocket works. And it's really, really cool. And if you're getting these kits, tell us in the comments what you think about this kit. If not, get them if you can. They're amazing and really cool and science. So yeah, thank you for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye!